welcome back everyone so today in this video i will be explaining that why you should always create a restore point on windows 10 and windows 11. now you might be aware that system restore is a free microsoft windows tool designed to protect and repair the computer software so basically system restore take a snapshot of the system file and the windows registry and save them as a restore point so why is it important now let's say that in future if your computer get crash you get any kind of blue screen or your computer get attacked by some kind of hackers or you think that you have downloaded a lot of virus and malware on your computer or even if any kind of data loss happen then at least instead of feeling a guilt you will have an option to restore your computer back to the stage when it was working fine okay so it's creating it it's a very simple task and it only take about a minute to create a restore point so on your windows 10 or 11 what you will have to do click on your windows search and just type create and in the suggestion somewhere you will be getting create a restore point now click on it and you will be getting this kind of system properties now below it says create a restore point right now for the drive that have system protection turned on in case the create option is not highlighted then you will have to click on configure and make sure the system protection has been turned on if not then enable it click on apply click on ok now you can click on create now give any kind of name or date that you can identify so that in the future if you want to restore back then you can easily identify this restore point so i will give the today's date so that i can easily remember it that when exactly i created and then you have to click on the create button and it will take only few seconds to create a restore point and once it will be created it will give you a message the restore point was created successfully so you can click on close and ok now you're all done so now let's say that in future if you have any kind of problem with the computer you have lost any kind of data or you feel that while browsing you have downloaded too much of malware and virus somewhere you are compromised then what you can do you can go back to the restore point that you have created so it's very simple you have to click again on the window search type restore click on create a restore point now this time here in the system restore you have to click system restore here then you have to click on next so now here you will find the restore point that we created you can see the description and the date so i know that i have created this restore point on this particular date and even if you have created multiple restore point all the date will be displayed over here all the restore point will be shown over here so whichever date you want to go back you can select it you can click on next and once you click on finish it will start restoring your computer back to the previous stage when the computer was working absolutely fine okay so this can be the first scenario now let's say that if you are stuck on a blue screen that says automatic startup repair fail that is a kind of a blue screen so what you can do you can fix your computer by going and using the restore point so in this kind of blue screen where it says automatic startup repair failed you get an advanced option you can click on it and in case if you don't get this option or you get any other kind of blue screen then you will have to start the computer three times forcefully so what you can do press and hold the power button forcefully shut down the computer once it gets shut down again turn it on and as soon as you see the windows logo or the manufacturer logo again forcefully shut it down you need to repeat the step for three times and then you will be getting the advanced option and once you come to this advanced option now here you have to click on troubleshoot click on advanced option and here again you will find the system restore option so you can click on it and then you have to click on next again here you will find the same date when you have created a restore point so let's say as i said you are stuck on a login screen or you're not able to come to your computer or you're getting any kind of a blue screen then from the login page only you can come to this option and restore your computer so that all kind of problem can get fixed 
Now these are the multiple reasons why I'm recommending you that you should create a restore point right now because I have seen majority of the people they are not using this option. Okay, so that's all guys for today. Hopefully you will find this video and information useful. And if yes, do not forget to like and subscribe for more related videos in the future. If you have any kind of doubt, any question, you can let me know in the comment section. And I see you in the next video. Bye-bye.